the things that um, I first got annoyed with APRS was these constant beepings, and I really didn't understand what they were. And what it is, it's their bell sounds for transmit or receive of APRS beacons and messages. Um, so these are the things that come to your radio uh, to tell you, hey, there's somebody out there uh, transmitting something. But you can get rid of some of these um, bells or what, a what this radio call uh, APRS ringer. And so what we're going to do is we're going to pare it down a little bit to certain sounds that you might like or what I do because um, constantly listening to this is a little annoying. So what you can do is you can press and hold display button if it lets you. APRS, number 10, APRS ringers or ringer. Okay, and then you have all these, okay? Uh, Mike E is uh, Mike and Quarter Beacon. I turned that off. Uh, position, right? Uh, rings when the position beacon is received. I turned that one off too. Um, weather, yeah, I turned that one off as well. Object. Um, object beacon, I turn that off. Item, that's the item beacon, I turn that one off as well. Of course, if the item beacon is something that you want on, absolutely. Status, uh, the status one, I don't think I need that one. Other, uh, beacon, other than what? is used by APRS is received. Nah. Uh, my packet, I probably want that one on. Um, the uh, bell that rings when uh, I self-transmit a beacon and relay wave is received. I might want, I want that one probably on. Message, somebody messaging, messaging me. Uh, message is received, sure. Group, well, I'm not part of a group, so I'm going to turn that off. So you can see I'm going, uh, moving the scroll wheel. BLN is bulletin message, so I do the scroll wheel. I press on display. I turn the scroll wheel to turn it on or off, and then I go back. My message, I'll leave on. Duplicate beacon, I'll probably uh, turn off. Duplicate message, I'll turn off. I only have to hear it once. This one, um, when response data of a message sent by your station is received, maybe I'll leave it on. Other messages, uh, when a message addressed to another destination is received, I'll turn it off, I guess. Let's see, this one's transmit beacon bell that rings when a beacon is being sent from your station probably and then text or sorry transmission or transmit message right rings when message is being sent from your station i'll probably that one on as well okay and as you can see the sound is a little bit better it's not constantly beeping or ringing all the time and it's only going to ring when I need it, when I the information that I want. So if you had the weather um, uh, ringer on, then it would beep if it's there's a weather um, uh, beacon turned on. Um, nobody's probably going to message me at this point right now. So when you do turn on or off these ringers, it doesn't mean that the beacons are not coming in to your radio because we can always press on the FMW button, S list for the station list, and these are still coming in. Okay, let's see. Uh, let's go to number one. You can see there's weather, right, coming in, but there's no messages that are coming to me directly. So this is one way to alleviate some of the 
noise that are coming into your radio that might be distracting you, uh, and only listening to those specific beacons that you're really interested in.